JB and the Verse Capo crew were out today training for ground operations. They had loaded up a Hercules with several ground vehicles and were embarking upon a practice run whereby they would drop 25 kilometers from their target at a height of several thousand meters in an attempt to drop behind an enemy target prior to being picked up by enemy radar. When driving off of a ship with a ground vehicle, it is very important to ensure that the aircraft is at a complete standstill, otherwise your vehicle will explode, taking the ship and everyone else on board with it. JB, keen to get onto the target, jumped the gun and caused the death of his entire crew. Oh, there you go. Good. <laughs> What the fuck happened? Undeterred by this setback, JB and the Verse Capo crew regrouped and set off to try again. Failures like these are great learning opportunities and making them during a practice run is the preferred environment for mistakes and lessons. The crew began reloading the ground vehicles on board the Hercules. Fury Clamshell, keen to ensure that there were no more untimely explosions, was being extra careful with his vehicle. <laughs> this is as fast as it'll let me go. No, uh, I've, I've turned them off. Make sure you're leveled so that you're straight in the anger. Right, now we need one more uh, cyclone. Once loaded, it was time to depart and to try again. Right, go, 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 go. The long drop had some crew members worried about their ability to survive the fall. Holy shit. But these light ground vehicles are immune to fall damage at the moment. You're clear if you didn't figure it out. Nice. And are excellent options for troop deployments. Oh, the criminals! Don't shoot, who's shooting? Trigger happy, Arnie. Yeah, testing us. Come in, and contact. Oh, oh, you're alone. Once on the ground, JB rendezvoused with the rest of the ground crew and they departed to the outskirts of the target location. Stay frosty, Arnie. I am cold. Verse Capo Doctrine suggests that the ground forces advance once an artillery barrage has been unleashed, so the ground force held their position until they were given the green light to move in. Boom! Oh, oh. <coughs> oh nice! Okay. That was okay. good. No. That was awesome. With the verse capo aircrew obtaining air superiority over Ghost Hollow and the artillery strike taking out some of the ground forces and thinning out the enemy numbers, JB and the Verse Capo ground force entered the zero line and began to clear out any survivors. Arnie, bring the rain, mate. We need that. Ah, uh, putting right. it out there, mate. Putting it down. I'm fighting the earth, man. I'm not sure what's fighting on the ground. We are. We're fighting people. All right. JB, careful. I'm in the tree above you. JB, holding back with medical equipment, should the ground force require it, took a step back to observe the verse Capo crew successfully take and hold the site. If you enjoyed this content and you think we deserve it, please consider supporting this channel by liking and subscribing so you never miss an episode.